Yo, what is going on YouTube? It's Souls and Laces back with another video. And for today's video, I got another pickup. Well, it was actually another package that I ordered over the weekend and it just arrived today. And by the time I post this video and edit it, it will probably be Thursday or Friday. So, um, but yeah, so here are the latest kicks and um, let's get right into it. All right, so you know how we do. I gotta start off with the box, especially for a sneaker like this. So, nothing special really. The Adidas ZX series right there, with your tree foil logo. It's just a standard white box. I expected a little something better. But yeah, let's start off as we always do with the box label. So we got right here the Adidas ZX 10,000, the Krusty Burger, that's the color. So I got a size seven and a half. And right here you got white, Subco, and other stuff that I'm not sure what it is. And these retailed for 130, and then after tax it was like 145, I believe. But yeah, let's not waste too much time. I know you guys know what this colorway is from the from the thumbnail. But yeah, let me bring out the kicks and I'll be right back. All right, so here we go. Here's a look at the sneakers. This is the Adidas ZX 10,000 and the Krusty Burger colorway. So I know most of you guys probably seen this TV show. Most of you guys should know this show, but if you don't, this sneaker is inspired by Krusty the Clown from The Simpsons. And when I first saw images of it, I was like, wow. It's kind of an interesting sneaker. I know not for a lot of people because it got kind of a lot going on. And just some, for some, it might be some colors that they don't really like combined together. But for me, um, I kind of, I'm kind of a sucker for when um, Sneaker Brands does you know kind of collabs and they put like a cartoon theme to it and so in this case they got adidas and simpsons together they came together on this model right here which i like but um let me get let me give you guys a quick 360 of the sneaker All right, so these came out, I believe, over the weekend, I think February 13th. And it was it was available for a draw on the Adidas Confirmed app, but also a couple of other sneaker stores and boutiques got these. And I got these off of Packer Shoes. And I'm surprised I actually got them because when I went to check back the site, it was sold out like two minutes after I got mine. So, so I got through and um, Good thing I did get them on Packer because I didn't know about the results on the confirmed app until like I want to say like half an hour to an hour after I got these so I took a I took a L on the confirmed app but I got them on Packer so that's good but um we kind of got a lot going on on this sneaker so I'm gonna try to break it down as best as I can so let's start off how we always do so like I said, this whole sneaker is inspired by Krusty the Clown from The Simpsons and his um, restaurant. So over here, you got this white TP unit for support of the sneaker. Then right here, you got like a, I guess it's like a canvas type material. Then right here, you got like a red foam unit. You got the Adidas Torsion logo right here. So this part right here, it feels like a, I wouldn't necessarily necessarily say suede, but it does feel like some type of synthetic suede. Right here, you got the Adidas Three Stripes logo and that teal type color. But at the tips of it, you got like black. And again, you got the TP unit right here for the laces. And right here, so since it's Krusty the Clown inspiration, these little like dots right here stitched in onto the onto the brown is supposed to resemble a burger bun, and this is supposed to be the sesame seeds. Just pretty cool details. 
and around the around the shoe you got like a black outlining so it definitely gives it like a cartoon vibe take a look at the toe box so right here you got like almost like an off-white type of color right here again on the red it's almost the same material as you see on the pink on the side right here to the toe box it's very soft right here at the toe it feels almost like a satin material but I guess the best way to explain it is like a nylon material right here you got the adidas torsion logo and your baby blue you got white laces going up for the tongue it's almost the same material as the toe box so it got like a nylon touch to it got your adidas logo right there almost like miami beach type vibes right there let's take a look at the back so this this is kind of my favorite part of the sneakers so right here this fabric is supposed to resemble Krusty's hair and then right here in the center you got the adidas tree foil logo so i think they kind of made it look like Krusty the clown and they did a really good job because this is like almost supposed to be like his hair and you kind of see the same material on the jordan 8 on the tongue so that's why it looks a little familiar you got that white midsole that wraps around the sneaker take a look at the medial side the medial side is almost the same as the lateral side except you don't have the torsion logo right here in the center you got your white midsole a foam midsole i believe this is and it comes with a little bit of extra so right here you got i guess you can call them torsion plates that you can kind of remove it from the laces so as you saw the standard one comes in this baby blue one but since it is a Krusty the Clown shoe I had to go ahead and swap it out real quick and see how it looks so that's what it looks like pretty dope I love when sneaker brands include a little sign like this so very very dope and um, it also did come with a set of extra laces so you got these right here in black and then on the tips it says AZX series, so almost the same style like you see of the, the Simpsons lettering. Which is pretty cool. Take a quick look at the outsole. So for the outsole, you got your gum bottoms. Right here you got soft soft cell, uh, which is Adidas, I guess, cushioning. And right here you have torsion and baby blue. Well, a teal blue actually. And you got that white right there. Very nice. And let's take a look at the insoles. So you got your Adidas Tree Fire logo again right there. And the Simpsons in black. Pretty cool. And then you got a black sock liner right there. So overall, it is a pretty dope sneaker. I know a lot of people were not feeling these, but I personally was. Like I said, I'm a sucker for shoes like this that have kind of like a theme to it. And I have several other sneakers as well. So if you look right here at the bottom, I got the Quagmire SBs, the highs. And then beneath it, you have the Doraemon, if I'm pronouncing that right. It's a Japanese anime. And I actually have the Quagmires right here in hand. So just a quick look. So Quagmire is also a character from another cartoon, Family Guy. And Quagmire's shirt is blue and red, just like the sneaker. And it also has like these, I guess you can say stars on his shirt. So that's why they included the stars on the sneaker. Came out really nice, so pretty cool. I like when, like I said, I like when sneaker brands do this. But um, in terms of sizing, I think I would recommend going true to size. So I got these in a seven and a half, which is my true to size. I tried them on without socks. It feels a little big, but that's because you don't have, or well, that's because I didn't have socks on. So I did have some space, but I think you will be good if you go true to size. But unless you like your shoes a little tight, then maybe you can go down half a size and I don't know what market aftermarket prices are going for these. I think it's pretty much retail. So if you want a pair, you can grab them for retail. It is a pretty dope sneaker overall. 
And um, who doesn't like The Simpsons? I mean, I'm not really a, too much of a big fan. I've seen some episodes, but... And um, the only complaints I really have about the sneakers is that I wish they did a little more just with the box. Maybe add... Maybe the box could have been in blue or black and yellow. You know, just something different, but... Not gonna complain too much about that. S sneakers are dope. So, like, I s it's pretty much wraps up the video. So, they thank you guys for tuning in. Like, comment, and subscribe. If you guys are new, subscribe to the channel. Make sure you guys click the bell button so you're notified of my new videos. And as always, you guys can follow me on the Instagram at souls underscore and laces. And until next time, guys, I'll see you on the next one. All right. Peace.